Detectives believe the eyewitness could have easily become the gunman's third victim. He had seen our suspect face to face. Journey from the law office above comes to investigate the loud bangs. Fairfield 911, dispatcher 508. I need an ambulance to 1438 Post Road, Donnelly Jewelry. 1438 Donnelly Jewelry? What's going on at Donnelly's? It looks like Tim Tim may have been shot. You think he was shot? I think he was shot. Okay, at Donnelly's? Donnelly Jewelry. You see him? Yeah, I sure did. He was probably 19, 20 years old. He had uh, piercing blue eyes. Hey, buddy. We got dollar shots. Okay. Thanks. You bet. Dude, it's a five dollar minimum. Actually, I mean, I thought that y'all would have worked out very well. Both of you fit the parameters in the scoring that I do to a perfect. What scoring? What? Crazy over what? Well, no, not no, not at all. Not not at all. I have different tests that I use and different analogies and stuff that make everything uh, kind of flow. Um, yeah, we actually even do a pheromone count. She preps her ingredients, waiting for her daughter Christine to arrive. How are those cookies coming? Get them ready to cut them out right now. She's running late. You know what? She promised me that she would be here this afternoon when I spoke to her, and she hasn't shown up yet. Don't worry about it. She's just hanging out with you. Night it is. Call me. You don't know where she is. She'll be home shortly. Just take a deep breath. And she'll be okay. Do you know if the child is okay? Well, sure, he's, he's with his father. We were relieved in that sense that the child was okay. We started to ask them about Christine, where she was that day. She's going to come to the house to make Christmas cookies. Do you think that Zach might have had anything to do with this? Is there any chance... Oh, I mean, Zach's, Zach is part of our family. Do you have any family in the area? 